Hi, I'm Brock Archer with Advanced Extrication. Welcome to Extrication Minutes, Tuesday on Fire Engineering. This week we're going to talk about electric doors and gaining access. So guys, in this Extrication Minutes video, we're gonna do something really quick. We're just gonna talk about gaining access to doors that utilize electric latches. So we're used, this is what we're used to. We're used to having a handle and then metal linkage within the door that opens up the latch. Well, in the last five or six years, we've had several manufacturers come out with doors on the outside where the handle then activates an electric latch, which opens up that door for us. So you can see how at an incident, we may have cut 12 volt power or the pyrotechnic terminal may have disconnected 12 volt power if we had airbag deployment. So there may not be 12 volt power present when we go to open the door from the outside of the vehicle. In that case, of course, an electric latch isn't gonna work. Here's what we need to know as rescuers. The inside is going to be linkage operated, mechanically operated. So if we can just access the inside handle to that door, that's gonna get that door open. SAE recommends that for manufacturers, so we're gonna see that in all production level vehicles. Any manufacturer that makes over 3,000 vehicles a year will see that mechanical linkage on the inside handle of the door, even when we don't see it on the outside. Many vehicles utilize this. This Tesla Model S is one of the many examples of vehicles that are now using electric latches on their outside handles for their doors. Hey, thanks for watching this week's Extrication Minutes. I'm Brock Archer. Take care. Be safe.